And now, your Storm Team 18 forecast, weather from where you live. Well, good Tuesday morning. Temperatures are kind of ranging from the mid-20s to the lower 30s. 30 Monticello, 31 Kokomo. Well, it's 25 Frankfurt, Crawfordsville, 24 for down the Wabash, 24 Lafayette and Attica this morning. So we'll call it even mid 20s to lower 30s. Storm to BT radar and satellite were all clear. We're going to be seeing a lot of sunshine here today. A lot of blue sky expected here for your Tuesday. It'll get a little breezy at times uh, 53 by 3 o'clock and 4 o'clock. Then we'll start to drop by 5 o'clock, but otherwise not a bad day ahead of us. But one thing to note too, uh, very dry air in place and with the windy conditions, it could elevate the fire throughout out there. So try to refrain from burning outside if you can any uh, wild ember could definitely start a little brush fire or so. So be just aware for that forecast. A lot of sun tomorrow. We'll have a little bit more clouds by the afternoon for your Wednesday. It'll be warmer too. 56. That's about 10 degrees above normal and enjoy it. I think Wednesday will be the pick of the week here before we start seeing some rain chances. So that's where we'll pick up some our future cast here. Seven o'clock in the morning. Notice the south wind not very breezy tomorrow. We'll have a little bit more upper level clouds for Wednesday, but still should be a very nice day to get outside and maybe get uh, the leaves all picked up, uh, some twigs, get some yard work done. But as we get toward Thursday, we'll increase clouds a little bit more. But then by the evening hours, most of Thursday will be dry. But by Thursday evening, well, this is 1030. We might have a few scattered showers around. Doesn't look like a hard hitting system. We'll just have some stray showers here Friday morning and then getting out of here by later in the morning, early afternoon. Then we'll start to dry things out really by the afternoon Friday. So most of Friday looks dry as well. Again, most of the rain will be coming in Thursday night into Friday morning. Friday afternoon evening will be dry going into Saturday morning as well will be dry, but then our next system comes in for Saturday evening. This is four o'clock so late afternoon into the evening are the latest projections that have been showing this morning through all the data I've been sifting through. And then as we get this out of here by Sunday morning, may see a few couple flurries wrapped around, but I think most of this should stay has rainfall, but the first system that will come through for Friday morning, maybe a tenth of an inch or less of rain, but I think the heavier hitting rain comes in for that uh, system Saturday night into Sunday morning, maybe another half an inch uh, could be possible with that system working in. So we'll definitely pay close attention to the forecast. Thankfully, most of the rain will fall during the evening hours. Uh, for Thursday, Friday, and then tracking those rain showers Saturday afternoon into Sunday morning. But again, the good news is really the temperatures staying above freezing across the entire 70 before we start to cool off a little bit next week. Yeah, the rain is a little bit better for travel than the yes. uh, than the snow, I would assume. Yeah, I think a lot of people would agree with that too, that yeah. uh, we will be seeing those warmer temperatures. But Thursday really doesn't look too bad for yeah. Thanksgiving, just those evening showers We'll be watching closely. Yeah, not too bad of a week here for us for our no. holiday here. Not it, bad. And tomorrow is going to be a great day to get outside and just prepare for, you know, winter coming in and yeah. all that. But uh, no, it looks like a pretty decent forecast. All right, David, thank you.